let's talk first dates and fashion. So big topic that's going around in the circle of Lauren is first dates and what to wear on a first date. I'm single, a bunch of my friends are single, so this is like a big thing that we're texting each other about. I've got a date, what do I wear? So I figured let's answer this once and for all on video so I can help my friends out and I can help all of you friends out there as well, especially the ones, you know, on Tinder swiping and uh, getting some getting some dates happening. So the biggest hurdle that, you know, my girlfriends are running into is finding something to wear that doesn't make it look like you're trying too hard. All, all the girls are like, I don't want him to think that I'm trying too hard, that I think this is like, you know, more special than it should be. There's a lot of overthinking going on with us women in our outfits and our dates. Here's the deal. Dudes, not a lot of thinking going on in their minds when it comes to our attire, first dates, and sometimes, to be honest, not a lot of thinking going on up there in general. You know what I'm saying? Sorry, dudes. I've heard it from a dude's mouth that sometimes y'all just don't really think. So I asked some dudes, because who better to ask than some dudes to get advice on what they want to see a woman in for a first date. You know, I have my own ideas, but really the dudes know best in this scenario, even if their thinking ain't sharp 100% of the time. So my, the first dude friend that I asked, I was showing him some pictures of dresses and was like, you know, if I were to wear this on a date, what would the guy think? And he was like, it's great. He said that he loves it personally when women dress up for dates. Dresses, skirts, all good in the hood. What he doesn't like is women who dress overly sexy when it comes to dresses and skirts and things like that. So he's like, of course it looks hot when a woman's overly sexy, but in his mind, He's like, this is never going to be a girlfriend, and this most certainly is not going to be marriage material. The best that she could be is like a hookup. He's not taking her seriously. So definitely, if you're looking for something more real, skip the cleavage, skip the mini skirts. Let's not show like booty, boobs, too much leg, whatever else you could possibly show that'd be too sexy, too much stomach. Keep it together ladies let's keep it together not too sexy so for him that's a turnoff but wearing you know a, a classy tasteful dress turn on so that's one dude's advice ask another dude and this dude that I asked he's like early 30s ask another guy he's in his 40s he's at the age where he's looking to like you know wife up settle down and he said the three elements that he looks for in a woman on her first date attire is clean, classy, and sexy. So clean, makeup nicely done, hair groomed, nails cleaned, you know, take a shower. Ladies, take a shower before your date. He wants it clean. And he said he likes sexy, what guy doesn't, but classy classies mixed in there. So it kind of speaks to dude number one who was like, I love a dress, I love form fitting, all that stuff, but not over the top. So not showing a lot of skin. So this could most certainly mean a great dress, even could be a bodycon dress, like show that you have a shape. Guys want to know this stuff. Come on, they're guys, like what do you expect? But you can do it in a way that is very classy. Then I asked dude number three what he thought. And he said for first date dressing, he likes a woman that looks like she put a little effort into her look. So this doesn't have to mean a dress or a skirt. It could mean jeans, pants. It could mean a lot of things, but it's all about the effort. So if it looks like, you know, you know this, I got my like bumming around the house clothes. If I was like, oh cool, time for a date. Let me like grab my bag. 
that shows no effort. It's not showing respect towards the man who's taking you out or the date or the potential relationship in general. So something that shows effort is really a turn on for him. So that's three different dudes' opinions. Ain't none of them said nothing about trying too hard. What they did say was too sexy. And ladies, we know what too sexy is. It's too much boobs, it's too much butt, it's too much leg, it's too much stomach. Dressing feminine does not mean too sexy, okay? So bust out a dress, bust out a skirt. It's feminine. You don't have to worry about looking trashy or that you're trying too hard. I'm giving you permission in case you needed it. You probably don't, but I'm giving you permission to like girl it up. Like dates are tragic a lot of the time, but they're also kind of fun too. The excitement of getting dressed up and wondering what's going to happen, how it will go. A lot of times we don't get to wear our special clothes because there's no occasion for it. So let the date be the occasion and have a little bit of fun with it, right? I think we can do that. I went on a date the other night and I was like, you know what, whatever. I'm wearing a skirt, I'm wearing a little crop top. I was like, I'm gonna look fly. I don't care how this date goes. I'm gonna look good. And I felt good. And that, to me, made the date worth it. I won't get into details, but I felt really good. So that's my advice on first date dressing. I hope that it was helpful. I would love to hear your thoughts on this subject, actually. Tell me what you usually wear on a first date. Um, what are your thoughts on like girling it up on a first date? Maybe you're just not that type of gal and you're just not gonna do it. I would really love to hear about it because I think this is a really interesting topic and it comes up for women you know, in our age group a lot. So sharing is caring, right? Speaking of caring, I care about your fashion questions. I care about the advice that you want to hear. So if you have a question for me or you want me to like blab about a certain topic, leave it in the comment section below. You can go to my website, laurenmessiah.com, and you can shoot me an email there with your question. You can hook up a question on social media and I will deliver an answer to you right here on video. Speaking of videos, I'm doing these bad boys five days a week. So please subscribe to my YouTube channel because I don't want you to miss a single video and I'll catch you guys in the next one.